Hello friend, welcome to this channel. My name is Nipx and today I come along with a video titled How to make a animation CD cover with audio spectrum by using Photoshop and Adobe After Effects. Even though my English is not really good, I'll try my level best to make you understand all the process and hope you will enjoy this. So again, mind you, subscribe to my channel share and leave a comment below i'll know what to add and you can you can advise me and so on you are welcome so to follow along you will need a working adobe photoshop so you will come here and create a new layer after creating creating you will come to film and video and choose hdtv 1080 and then create after creating come and press link d i'm going to press link d scd png which i have downloaded it on google you can google cd png and you will have something like this after that i'll i'll make it and i'll come and draw a rectangle draw a rectangle to fit on top of your cd cover cd png not cd cover this will this rectangle we are going to use it as a cd as a cd cover so reduce the opacity in order to see and you can zoom you can zoom in and make it a little bit like like that you can see at the top make it like that yes and at the bottom like that and again you can zoom out and make it to fit to fit on your CD PNG like this like this after that click OK and arrange it at the middle middle point of your CD you will see the line to guide you here like like that time you see the top line the middle one and the bottom line I'll press like that and I'll increase the opacity to normal 100 value after doing so come here on the properties if you don't see the properties come to window and then click on the properties it will pop like this one and try to reduce the angles the top angle like this one I'll make it not too much like like this one yeah as you can see it's and it's it's the move it has it had collected the angle yes like this one you can increase it a little bit that one is okay after that make it fit on screen so all you need to do is press link the your image which you have already made it as a cover for this we are going to use acoustic guitar so i made something for acoustic guitar so i'll come here and again press link d and i'll come i'll choose my image and i'll press link d on top of this i'll make it fit even though it's not fit because i'm going to clip mask it and i'll come and choose clipping mask as you can see it's had give a nice look so come here at the rectangle and select vfxc branding mode and choose bevel and embrace embrace i think embrace my pronunciation is not good but hope you understand 
after that keep the value as it is on my on my computer as you can see and then come at dropping shadow we need to drop shadow a little bit on this CD so as you see as I can move this you can see a shadow is dropping so I'll keep a small one like like this one yeah this one is this one is like this one is good we are good to go after that we have already done with our cd cover so i'll make a group of them create a group and rename it cd cd cover CD cover after renaming it as the CD cover you can turn it off so we are going to work with this CD so come here and make a copy of it after making a copy of it you can turn off this and come to this at the bottom and then press link I'm going to press link the same picture I used it to make for acoustic guitar and then I'll press link after that I'll reduce my picture if you are using CC 2018 and below you will need to hold shift before reducing like this for my case I'm using CC 2019 I can reduce the opacity in order to see through what I'm going to do like this one increase the size like this this is for the purpose of training and then make it 100 and then creep mask it after creep mask it you'll have something like this one so come and again choose an ellipse tool reduce the opacity to see through the CD we want this effect we want this style of the CD at the middle so I'll make an ellipse I'll draw an ellipse on top of it and make it fit by holding shift make it fit nicely you can zoom and use a low key use the allow key to make it fit like there for the purpose of raining it's okay and again on your keyboard hold control and then select on the ellipse you will see a selection like this you can turn it off after that select your picture and then come on the select and select inverse after select inverse add the layer mask as you can see we have updating such that effect that style at the middle of the cd so come here and increase an opacity to 100 congratulations you have done it when you turn on the cd you can see that effect it's cool yes it's cool After that, we can continue. I can add and um, I can add some mold. I, I can light acoustic, uh, acoustic, acoustic, acoustic song. And arrange it like this one it's nice after that after that you can delete this ellipse you can delete it and then re remember that we we put a CD on top so we want to use this CD effect 
this effect to apply it on a on our cd so we will come here blending mode change it to to soft light and and reduce reduce the opacity to 25 like this one yes it's cool as you can see here it has a shining it had put a shining effect yes so you can switch on ah congratulations you have made it so after that you can switch it off and try to arrange this but before that select the cd and come on vfx select stroke after selecting stroke make the setting as you can see soft light opacity make an opacity 25 and here gradient choose a gradient choose this one or you can choose this one and you can use the setting as you can see yes and then create click ok after that arrange this arrange it and keep a group rename it to C CD so turn it on as you can see congratulations once again so come at the background remove this one and select vfx make color gradient i'll make a gradient wow this is nice but i don't like it i'll make it i'll make i'll use custom gradient like this one yes we can use this one and put a blending mode to multiply and reduce the opacity reduce the opacity to be like this yeah this is nice so after that we need to put a shadow here for our cd so i will come and select an ellipse and draw something like this yes put it here and arrange it nicely put a color totally black again come at the filter and select bra and gaussian bra yes convert to smart object and reduce it to be like like this you can arrange it yes like this one it's nice as you can see so rename it and light it shadow shadow so this you can name it as background bg let me write bg background so we are ready to go for the after effect come here and save your work save us i prefer saving my work on psd that i have created and uh, i'm advising you to create a folder to save your work so i'll save it as cd animation and then save okay so congratulations we are ready to go in after effect